Hello everybody, welcome to Miss with PJ. Today's date, October 26, 2016. Our word for discussion is rooms. In Genesis 6.14, make thee an ark of gopher wood. Rooms shall thou make in the ark, and shall pitch it within and without with pitch. In 1 Chronicles 4.41, and these written by name came in the days of Hezekiah, king of Judah, and smote their tents and the inhabitations that were found there, and destroyed them utterly until this day, and dwelt in their rooms, because there was pasture there for their flocks. In Mark 12:39, in the chief seats in the synagogues, and the uppermost rooms at the the feast in Luke 2 20 46 beware of the scribes which desire to walk in long robes and love greetings in the markets and the highest seats in the synagogues and the chief rooms at feast this word defined as space that can be occupied where something can be done especially viewed in terms of whether there is enough, a part or division of a building enclosed by walls, floor, and a ceiling. When Jesus ascended into heaven, he told his disciples to wait in the upper room ten days for the coming of the Holy Spirit. Beware of the rich man, for he tends to display his riches and has the best rooms. God hears our prayers when we speak privately to him in a quiet and enclosed room. I want you to think about this today. Have a blessed day.